Hello guys, and today we're going to be playing some Minecraft PE. And uh, I bet you're wondering what we're going to be doing in Minecraft PE. I'm going to be showing you guys how to make an automated sugarcane farm. Sorry for the background noise, it's just the TV, I have it on and... Yeah, so I am going to be showing you how to make a cane farm, an automated one. And we're going to, for the sake of this video, I'm going to put turn keep inventory on and we're going to make it a flat world. Just for the sake of this. Oh wow, that's a very interesting fact. The original name for Minecraft was Cave Game. Put like this video if you already knew that. And if you didn't, still like the video. And guys, I will be giving away 20 Robux to do whatever you want with. So put your put your Roblox name down in the description. So all you have to do is put your Roblox name in a comment, so like the video, subscribe to the video, and watch till the end, and I'll tell you the rest of the way to get to get the to get twenty robux. So that's all you have to do for now. Don't post the pu the public comment yet. Oh wait, yeah, sugarcane observer we need we need we need stone well actually we need cobblestone we need redstone this is actually a very simple build and and pistons oh and water and a hopper and a chest if you want it to be even more automated. Hopper. Chest. Here we are. The chest skin looks really weird. Okay, first step. Make a thing however long you want the cane farm to be. For me, it's going to be... Um, it's going to be however long I want it to be because I'm not really counting right now. And, oh, is that my mum? Nah, doesn't matter, guys. Um, sorry, if my mum catches me on my iPad trying to record a Minecraft video in the mornings, she will snap. And she, I won't be able to upload for ages, which would be awful, guys, wouldn't it? We would not like that. Me not being able to upload for ages would be a bad thing. Very bad thing. Then you guys wouldn't have anybody to watch. Because I'd be gone, and there'd be no one else who's good quality, so... Yeah. No one else with good quality videos, so... I wonder what we're going to do. And then put hoppers in the middle and put water in each edge. Then put some... Oh, wait, I did this wrong. I forgot about sand. You need to do it with sand. forgot about that. Not cobble. Well, guys, I will... We are currently experiencing technical difficulties. I will be a couple seconds, and then I will tell you when I'm ready. Oh no, this is not good. Okay, so guys, I have finished rebuilding this. I want to get water. 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 There we are. Okay. Now, all we need to do is place cobblestone around here. Like so. One more block up. Then we go 
like that we keep going until it's around all the sides now what we have to do is put a piston a piston a piston a piston a piston just keep putting pistons we'll need a lot of pistons I'm not really counting how many we need because I don't feel like it and then we go like this Oh. and then you put the observers like this So, yeah, observer, 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 and just keep going until they're all like that, until all that, they're all like the way I did it. It's actually quite simple, this. And I got, and guys, I will prove to you that this works by making sugarcane grow. And if you didn't know, you can actually bone meal sugarcane. I only found it out a couple days ago, because it doesn't really make sense that you'd be able to bone meal sugarcane, but, you know, Minecraft doesn't make sense. It doesn't have much grav uh, laws, it doesn't have many laws of physics in it, and laws of uh, gravity and stuff like that, and laws of the world. <laughs> Just being silly. Um, and then like this. And then once we've done that bit, you put redstone down. Like that. And you will see the second I place down, I will, the second I bone meal, or not bone meal, but place a piece of cane up where the observer is. It will activate the pistons, which will therefore break the, which will therefore break the sugar cane, which will go into the hopper, which will lead into a chest underground. Or it will lead into more hoppers that lead into a chest above ground. That's what I'm thinking of doing, guys. So, I'm going to make it a nice automated one. Oh, come on. I need night vision. Slash, slash effect. Night. Oh, sorry, guys. Night. Uh -uh. I'm a little bit flimsy with typing. It's a small iPad that I have, so... It's kind of hard. 10,000 seconds, which makes it unlimited. Oh, not water. 255. Done. So now we can see underwater. Oh, not we, but I. Shoot, guys! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Silly me! Mm. I'll just break that block, and we are now going to be. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties again. I will be a couple seconds, guys, while I just place that back, and then do this. Okay. Shoot. 
And guys, the second I finish making this and I show you how it works, I'll probably have to end the video. So, very sorry. And, yeah. Then it will suck them up. And then... This is how it's going to work. And boom. And that is how you make it. Just like this. And then I will prove to you guys that this works. Oh guys, I might have to be going in a couple of seconds. So, I see, watch this. And it breaks it. And most of it will fall into there and go through the hoppers and some bits will be left on the edge now all you have to do is plant the sugar cane which you can't do on the edges so leave the edges but, uh, alone and yeah that is this done guys so that is how you build a automated sugar cane farm and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!